What's up guys, welcome to part two of our Gloves Light Show tutorial video. Uh, again, we're Team Truth, my name is Gummy, and this is Aha. And uh, now it's time to start learning some moves. Now we're gonna start you off with the basics. Probably the most common move used in light shows is the figure eight. It's pretty basic, but it can be complicated uh, just learning it from the get-go. Um, basically, it's gonna look like this. Your arms are gonna do a figure eight and trace it out in uh, midair. To start learning this, what you're gonna have to do is to spell out an eight with one of your hands. If your left hand is start with your left, if you're right, start with your right. So here we go. Just tracing an eight in the air. And then to get the second hand in there, all it's gonna do is follow what the first hand was doing. So here comes the second hand there. It's just following the first hand. Then you wanna be able to reverse it as well and then come back. If you're having difficulty learning it that way, a good way to learn is to just put your both hands, put both of your hands out and just cross them, changing which hand goes over which. So starting with crossing with your right over your left, uncross, right under your left, uncross. Just doing that like this and then moving your hands up and down. And eventually, if you get this down, eventually you'll be comfortable enough to use your wrists as well and it should look like that. There's a diff different ways to do this. You can uh, put your wrists together and make it a smaller figure eight or make it a big one like this. In light shows, however, it's really uh, impactful to start off with just maybe one light, like say your thumb lights. Start with those doing a figure eight and then when the music hits or gets faster, spread out all of your fingers maybe or maybe while you're starting with your left, or I mean uh, with your thumb lights, just put in a different light so the figure eight changes color, so your thumb lights, and then boom, you switch to your pointer fingers. Another good one is starting with your lights all um, in, uh, put into one central point and uh, doing the figure eight, and then when the music hits, just spread them open so it makes, instead of a smaller, uh, more focused, figure eight, it's like a big wild figure eight with a big giant picture and it's really impactful. Next I'll be talking about the finger roll. It's a pretty simple move, but um, looks really cool if done correctly. Basically it's closing all of your fingers one by one in a row and then opening them back up again. And it should look something like this um, without gloves. To learn this, um, it's pretty simple. Just put your hands flat out, palms up, uh, pinkies touching, and just practice closing each finger individually while leaving the other ones open. Um, then coming back, opening them the same way, uh, starting from the direction that you closed at. So boom, 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 and then open again. You want to be able to do this both directions, so if you get comfortable closing it this way, try being able to start from the other side as well. And then come back. And then eventually you're going to build up your speed and be able to spin it like this. It helps to lean your hands in the direction that you're rolling towards. So maybe if you're going from this side to this side going boom like that and closing and then opening again to flat and going this way boom and then opening back up to flat and then you want to, like i said you want to be able to reverse it so keep it going like this and then going back and then back and then back uh it looks really cool with lights it's kind of like a liquidy wave type of move um you can practice this anywhere basically just you know pretty simple We're not exactly sure what most people call this move, but we've come to know it as the wheel. 
It's just basically taking um, your lights and spinning them towards you, um, towards yourself or towards the person getting the light show to make like a circle um, right in front of you. If you can't see that too well, this is what I'm doing. It's just kind of making a circle. It's pretty simple. Um, this works in light shows <coughs> as an impact move um, as well. You can um, start with one finger, so say your pointer finger, doing this, and then maybe start small and then get bigger and faster. And when the music hits or gets faster, then instead of just this light, throw in all of your lights at the same time. It'll be a bigger wheel with a bigger picture, a lot more colors. Um, also, you can also be doing this, like this, and then maybe switching your finger just like you did with the figure eight. So do this and then maybe switch to your thumb lights. So you still see the wheel, but the color's changed. So, you know, just mess around with it. It's a pretty simple move, but it looks pretty cool. Um, and it adds uh, another key move to your light show. If you took the advice from our first video and put a different light in your thumbs, a brighter light, this move will really help you out. It's um, called an impact move. And basically it's keeping your lights off for the first part of your light show until the music drops and then turning on your thumb lights as an impact, like boom, it's a different light now. Um, so you could be doing your finger rolls or your figure eights and then you can close your hands and while they're closed like this, switch on your other lights, your um, thumb lights, and then boom, in their face. Now it's a different light and it's really bright and it, like it goes with the music because once the beat starts getting faster, it's a different type of sound, so you should have a different kind of um, light as well. Okay, so uh, that's the end of our second video. Check out our third video on duos. Um, take what we've given you and practice all you can. All you need is personal space. Really, you don't even need your gloves to practice. Be creative in making your own new moves. And uh, there will be videos so you can look at tips. And remember to always flow with the music. It makes for the best light shows. And when you're giving a light show, tell the people to put their heads as close as together so it makes it easier on you and uh, while you're looking at other videos you don't want to steal moves because uh, you'll get caught easily and uh, if anybody catches you you'll get a right cross to the face thanks for watching